Hey Huns, I hope you're doing good. I am feeling in the festive spirit. I've got my cozy little cardigan on. And what better way to start off the festive season than by opening an advent calendar. And no, this isn't just your average, oh, reviewing beauty calendar, chocolate calendar, cheese calendar, whatever kind of bloody advent calendar you've got this year. This one is toy calendar i'm sorry i'm sorry 10 out of 10 it's 10 out of 10 because let's be real girls this is what we really want for christmas you know whether you're on santa's naughty or nice list i would like a dildo please <laughs> i was so lucky to receive and summer's advent calendar this year if you followed me for a while you know i did a review of one of them two years ago but back then i was a prude i was absolutely shocked by some of the things i've opened but i feel like i'm a bit further along in my journey right now i'm more like in tune with my desires so i'm very excited to open this today so if you want to see what's inside the 12 nights of pleasure calendar then just keep watching I mean, people have taken it too far with advent calendars now. You can literally get an advent calendar for everything. Like, some of them are a bit ridiculous. Like, I'm pretty happy with just a chocolate one, even though that my parents don't send me one anymore. Um, I know, child neglect, calling child line, I know. But this will definitely fulfill more than just my advent calendar needs. Ah, it looks so good. This is what it looks like. It's a very substantial box. I can hear the items are rumbling around. So it's 125, but it's worth 195. Sex toys and vibrators can be quite expensive, so this is definitely a good way to try it and a good way to, you know, spice up your sex life, whether with a partner or on your own. Let's just crack right into this, eh? All right, here we go. What's inside? I'm nervous, exhilarated, excited altogether. We'll discover your sensuality, indulge in your arousal. <laughs> okay, Anne Summers. Immerse yourself in self-love, yes, queen, with our range of luxury toys, accessories, and lubricants. I promise I wouldn't get embarrassed this time. I'm a grown woman. I'm 27 years old. The word lube shouldn't make me giggle, okay? Lubricant. <laughs> so it in strong with box number one. Let's see. Mm, we have, oh, it's a little eau de parfum. Enigmatic purse spray. Oh my God, is this one of those pheromone sprays? Oh, no, I can get behind this. Infused with pheromones, allure, romantics, no stop because these actually make people more attracted to. Aren't pheromones like your sexual hormones? Our new blend of pheromones adds a seductiveness to this uniquely irresistible scent. Well, I mean, we're gonna fucking try it, aren't we? So, because my friend, she also got one of these pheromone sprays from Anne Summers, and she said she like saw her ex again, and she sprayed it loads, and he was really like, oh my God, I miss you, and like hugged her, and was like, I'm telling you now, these pheromones, I also love that you can just keep it in your purse. If you're on a night out, spritz yourself, and all the boys will be going feral. Do you know what I mean? Like, it's just science. Little spray bottle. Oh, that. I think I just had a sexual experience. That is lovely. I'm really scared the postman's gonna come and smell this and like fall in love with me. I mean, do you know what? It's a gorgeous fragrance, whether the pheromone thing works or not. Maybe it's just placebo. If you put this on, you're gonna think you're being really sexy and attracting everyone. So naturally you just will. And I'm, you know, I'm gonna take those odds. So that is the first thing, very happy with that. Number two, number two, oh. Number two is down here. Honestly, acrylic nails was not made for boxes like this. Number two is... Ah! Be mature, be mature. Stop. <laughs> it's like a little rump and rabbit. It's a rabbit finger stimulator. I don't understand how it works. Is your finger like, what? Oh. Oh. Honestly, do you know what I love about these tiny little bullet things is it literally just looks like makeup. You know what this would be good for when you're going home to like spend Christmas with your family. Like obviously you're not going to bring like a massive vibrator. But if you bring something like this, they're never going to know. Like how will they know? I cannot seem to work out how to turn it on. I've like undone the batteries loads of times. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Like, these things are so fiddly. I think you, yeah, pop it into the rabbit and it should just make the whole thing shake and it might just be a bit more fun than just your standard bullet because these rabbit ears are really good for stimulating your clitoris. Okay, again, I'm a strong woman who can say those words. Pleasure is nothing to be ashamed about, ladies. Number three, menage a trois. 
Let's go. One, two, three, not only you and me. Do you remember that song from Britney? Iconic to be honest. She just made a song about threesomes and we all just glossed over it and forgot about it. Like it's just the most normal thing. Oh, okay. These look like little cards, little sexy playing cards, tips cards. Spend some time focusing on yourself, okay. Let me have a go. Oh, let me have a look at what we can do. Let's flip the eye mask on to enjoy some sensory play. I think I'd feel a bit claustrophobic on my own, like. Okay, so it's like little sex tips. Not overwhelmed by number three, to be honest. No, I feel like this is a little bit of a cop out. Like this isn't really, it's not really worth a box. And number three was such a big box. Just a bit let down, to be honest, Anne Summers. Like where are the zildos? <laughs> Four is for the whores. <laughs> That would literally be me if I did bingo. Okay, number four is, give me something good. Okay, orgasm gel. Ooh. Enhance your sensitivity with the intensely warming and tingling orgasm gel for use on all of your external erogenous zones. Erogenous is a word, you know like a word that you love to say but you never use, erogenous. Really love that word. I, do you know, I can't lie, I want to put this somewhere right now so I can feel it. Is it safe? Well, let's just put it on my hand for now. All right. Oh. So, guys, my hand is literally dripping with orgasm gel. I swear to God, it's in my fur. Why did I do that? I didn't open the lip. Oh! It's literally like all down my leg, all over the floor. I just wanted to feel like a little tingle and I got more than I bargained for. Great. Maybe it's just because it's on my hand. I'm not feeling any tingling yet. Feels like lube, but it says it's not to be used as a lubricant. It's not suitable for use with condoms, which I honestly am glad I read that because I only use condoms as contraception. So if this, just bear in mind, if you do the same, this will stop them working, which is not ideal. We don't want any unplanned pregnancies. I'm not feeling anything, but then I don't know if it's just because it's on my hand. Like maybe if it was on your vajay, it would feel better. Obviously I'm not gonna have an orgasm from it being on my hand, am I? Well, we're just gonna move swiftly on and I'm just gonna have to take their word for it that if you use it on more sensitive parts of your body that it feels good because this is giving nothing. Everybody, number five. I want to meet a sexy guy, number five. <laughs> right, it's the fifth day of December. You're feeling a bit horny now because you haven't got much to go off in the beginning days. I've just got some gel and some cards, you know? I, I feel like this needs to be something good. Okay, we are getting somewhere. <laughs> what is this? It looks like some sort of like wand toy. Mini wand. Mini but mighty. Experience waves of pleasurable sensations. The rounded tip ensures the vibrations reach a larger surface area. Love the colour. Lilac's very in, Nan Summers. This one is chargeable, so you don't have to faff around with batteries. These kind of ones are very good for using with someone else, because obviously they can like use it on you. You can use it during sex. It's quite easy to hold and like Get in those areas if you get what I'm saying. One's always best with your partner, I find. Also, this is a really interesting topic. Apparently, a lot of men are intimidated by sex toys. So if you have a small one, they're less likely to be intimidated. It's an easier way to like introduce it. Just get out of your bedside table and be like, hey, can you use my mini wand? Like they're not gonna be threatened in any way and they'll be like excited to get involved. So yeah, I'm very happy with number five. We're, you know, number five, we're feeling alive with the mini wand. <laughs> Guys, I've got it going. Oh, okay, it's very, it's very strong. V okay. Oh, it even has different Skrillex. God, you can have a lot of fun with this one. Okay, this is definitely the favorite so far. Loving this. Number six, give me a kiss. That's number six, give me a kiss. <laughs> this is a very little one. I'm hoping the best things come in small packages. I mean, when you're talking about sex toys, I guess that's not always the case. Ah, oh, another vibrator, bullet vibrator. Again, love the color. And again, just literally looks like a lipstick in your bag. Okay, you've got to remove the plastic from the battery. Actually stressful. Like, imagine you order all this stuff when you're horny and you like can't even fucking get the battery in. Like, what a, what a nightmare. Whoa. Okay, you don't need to hold it down, you press it. That, that is very powerful. Like, I'm, I'm a bit stressed with it. Can you hear that? It's got good little patterns as well. Does everyone use all these settings? Because I'm actually really boring. I use one setting. I think I need to, like, spice up my own sex life. Because I couldn't get this one to work. Oh my god, look. If you put it in the little rabbit, 
it does like make this fit tingle that is pretty fun and then you can just hold it on your hand like this again quite a cute one for a partner to use on you or you to use on yourself very subtle no one's gonna notice it in your bag like okay we're really getting into the calendar now i mean i'm i'm having a whale of a time three new vibrators already and we're only on number six we've still got six days to go so what more surprises could we honestly need seven minutes in heaven number seven i started out opening these so gracefully and now i'm just ripping them what do we have here oh uh, if this is another orgasm gel i'm gonna scream no it's a lube okay everyone can calm down water-based lube i really enjoy the packaging it's a bloody big bottle of lube 100 ml you don't need a lot of lube either it's a water-based lubricant so is that better for condoms i think it is use as much or as little as you like to heighten each sensation whilst gliding your toys into place i really don't like the words gliding your toys into place so that made me cringe Huh. Yes, it's suitable for use with condoms, but it's not a contraceptive. Remember that lube doesn't stop you getting pregnant or getting STDs. Does it smell of anything? No. Should we attempt to do this and not spill it everywhere? Yes. Okay, that's a nice thick bit of lube. Yeah, that feels lubricated. That does what you need it to do. Okay, lovely big bottle for you there. To glide your toys into place. Ugh. Lube is important. Especially for LGBT couples, especially for people who experience dryness, nothing to be ashamed of. Also, it just feels better, so buy a fucking bottle of lube or get this advent calendar. I'll link it in my description. <laughs> Number eight, let's go on a date. I'm enjoying myself way too much. Ah, we've got another one. Oh, 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 do you know what this is giving? Is this too rude to say? You know, have you ever been with someone who's, you know, it's a little bit crooked and they're like really insecure about it but it actually feels better like it's actually better for the girl when their thingy like leans a little bit so i see what they're doing this i'm telling you now this is going to be for the g-spot because obviously the g-spot is like located more inwards so that's what that is for and i'm i'm here for it yes i i was right i, I am literally uh gene milburn i'm literally gene milburn from sex education because like <laughs> smart smart G-Spot Vibrator, explore internal stimulation with the silicone vibrator. The curved tip is perfect for sending vibrations directly to your G-Spot. Body safe silicone, it's waterproof. So if you want to explore in the bath or shower, go for it. I've, I've only done that once. It feels all right. It sounds sexier than it is, actually. I feel like this is like a nice one to start out with exploring with G-Spot stuff. And it's not too big or aggressive. Some of them are a little bit aggressive, I'll be honest. I'm just a girl like I don't want scary looking sex toys okay like a little purple thing is so good for me right should we turn it on see this is a nicer like smoother one you know just this setting is good get ramping it up Jesus yeah similar they have all the 10 same ones I think most of them but they have different patterns different speeds you can work out what you like and I'm gonna throw out a crazy suggestion here what you could do is use two together because you've got the g-spot simulation and the clit simulation and together you're gonna have a great time you know have a hot date with two people just like Brittany said one two three not only you and me <laughs> I literally have a video call in my room in like 20 minutes and I'm surrounded by sex toys so we need to keep getting through this advent calendar because I they cannot see all this in my in the background okay number nine wine and dine why is there so many sirens going off they're coming to get me for being too sexual on YouTube oh this is feels soft this one Ooh, it's giving 50 shades of grey wow Christian grey we'll see you now <laughs> oh my god okay this is fun because this is multi-use you know you can use this to go to sleep and it won't irritate your skin or your hair block out the morning light or you know you can play around with a partner i think being blindfolded is very fun but it's a bit stressful because you're like oh what are they gonna do next like it's a bit like you lose control and i don't know if i like it also like they suggested in the cards in those brilliant educational cards that definitely worth putting in box three <laughs> said you can do it on your own you know try it out and just just have a little fun but overall it's just a nice eye mask okay i have no qualms about that number 10 i'm just ken anywhere else i'll be a 10 number 10 should have something good right oh they've got another perfume i'm telling you i'm actually just excited for these mostly 
still going strong this one aphrodisiac <sighs> Infuse of pheromones, eau de parfum. Okay, let's try this one too. Oh, I like that this one's blue. Got a bit of blue going on. It matches my nails. Oh, oh my God, I think I prefer this one. Mm. Oh my God, they're both so good. Like if they sold big bottles of this, I'd actually wear these as my perfume every day. Mm. I can kind of see how that would get you in the mood because that's, that's doing a lot for me already. And to be honest, I think with both of these perfumes, they would go with a lot of other perfumes you have. So if you're going on a date and you still want to wear your perfume, but just top it up with this and keep it in your bag. You know, when you go to the bathroom, you're like, sorry, I need to powder my nose. And you're like, pheromones, bitch. You're going to be in love with me. Fabulous. Legs 11. It's number 11. Is that what they say? Legs 11. I think I've heard that bingo. I don't actually know what it means. What does legs 11 mean? What are we going to get? It's my lucky day. Why am I looking around as if my neighbours are going to see me through the window? Like, <laughs> I swear, they must wonder what I do with my life. But I wonder it also. I have never, in my four years of talking about sex toys online, seen one shaped like this. It looks more like a spank thing or it looks like a leaf, to be honest. Maybe it's like autumnal themed. Panty vibe. Oh perfect shape to send targeted vibrations directly to the clitoris labia or nipple nipples <laughs> Nip nipples okay so what you just like put it in your pants like a little scoop or you can just lie on it i imagine i mean i've never tried anything like this but i'm very intrigued i think this is a good set especially for beginners or couples to kind of work out what you like like everyone needs to try different toys to know what they like like i personally prefer wands or like the vacuum not vacuum like suck but what are they called maniza like the clit stimulator wands they're my favorite and the wands compared to like the bullets but you know this could be my new favorite or you could actually prefer like the g-spot one like it's just figuring out what you like so you can get the best out of your sex life nice yeah nice nice i'm into that i'm into that i'm into the new innovation and summers woo number 12. Uh, i can't think of any rhymes i'm out of rhymes for number 12 no don't worry about it but well we've won the last one because in this advent calendar you only get 12 nights which i think is more than enough when it's sex toys how many do you really need this to me is giving dildo <laughs> okay <laughs> which is what we've all been waiting for it's a substantial package pardon the pun let's go and summer's final day oh my god jesus the neighbors better not be able to see me <laughs> I hope my parents are proud. This is what I've decided to do with my life. I'm proud. I'm proud of myself. Empowering women to take charge of their sexuality and their pleasure. Yeah, I am proud. But yeah, this is quite... <laughs> that's a sex toy. That is like a big boy. Do you know what I mean? That's, that's... When you think of sex toys, this is what you think of. Okay, this is one of Anne Summer's most iconic toys. It is the Pulsating Rabbit. I have never tried this exact one, but I've tried one similar. Smooth and sleek, the Pulse Rabbit has a unique pulse action to ma massage your G-spot. Let the rabbit is flicker against your clit for clitoris for a blended orgasm. So yeah, how it works is obviously this one goes inside, this one's for your G-spot, and this one is for your clitoris, so basically all parts are stimulated. Oh my god. Mate, it's all going on. There's so much to think about. The bottom one controls this one. This, this is crazy. I'm really overwhelmed, wait. That is madness. That is madness. These toys are really amazing because, you know, you don't really need a boyfriend if you have this. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. You actually don't. But yeah, it is great because all bases are covered and these I know are quite expensive so it's really good to have got this in the advent calendar. You need to try it to believe 
how fun it is so there we have it that is our 12 nights of pleasure with and summers you have to let me know in the comments if you think the calendar's worth 125 i definitely think it is because i know how expensive sex toys can be and it's just a fun way to get you in the mood spice up your sex life whether that's on your own or with a partner you have to let me know if you've tried any of these and what your favorite sex toy is in the comments and yeah thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed and i'll see you very very soon